Hey, good morning, everybody. It is Nugget of Truth time with Pastor Matt. The sign's kind of getting buried back there. It's Monday morning. The sun is out. It's cool, but I bet you it's going to warm up. Hope you had a great weekend. Uh, we we did uh, here on Saturday and Sunday. Um, all right, so Nugget of Truth, number 260. Jesus was a good listener. To be like him, we must also learn how to hear what others are saying. Jesus listened to his father in prayer all night in order to know his will. That's Luke 6, 12. We learn better in the university of silence. All right, so let's, um, let's think about this in two different ways. Have you ever been talking to somebody and you sense they just weren't listening to you? Um, boy, you don't feel connected to that person. And... Um, and to be honest, I'm sure a lot of people have felt that way in their conversations with me because by nature, I'm not a very good listener. My mind's kind of wandering and I kind of tend to focus on other things in the room. And so sometimes uh, you might have felt that way. So if you have, boy, I apologize because you're not the first. So so if, if you're <clears throat> talking to somebody and you sense they're not listening to you, you certainly don't feel connected and maybe you don't feel loved by them. You know, if you could extrapolate that out. So uh, Jesus was a good listener. I got a feeling when Jesus was talking to somebody, he, you know, they had his undivided attention. So in our horizontal relationships, it's really huge that we're good listeners. And that might just take practice and a change of really long ingrained habits. This pat, this verse, uh, the, the verse Luke 6, 12, I think it is. Um, he's talking about Jesus being a good listener to his father. Uh, he's in prayer all night because he doesn't always know what his father's will is, it would appear. Um, so uh, we need to be a good listener, whether it's to each other or be a good listener with God. So there's the two challenges. Um, how do we listen better to each other? How do we listen better to God? That's you know maybe the main thrust of this nugget of truth. We learn in the University of Silence. So that university of silence phrase might strike you as extremely profound or extremely kind of corny. So whatever, just so you remember it. So yeah, let's be good at listeners. Let's be better listeners. Let's start off with being better listeners. Uh, and then again, real quick, this Saturday, this coming Saturday is our all church breakfast at 830. We're having Chick-fil-A. If you want to come and you haven't reserved a spot yet, or not reserved a spot, but let us know your order, basically. Uh, let us know at connect at deeprivers.church. Connect at deeprivers.church. Um, it's just probably too late to fill out a connect card. And um, and if you're not coming for breakfast, I, I, I hope that you can come at 9 o'clock for our all-church meeting. So breakfast is at 8.30, all-church meeting is at nine. It won't be too long. We just want to get everybody together in one spot and update everybody on the good things that are going on. Take care. God bless. Bye.